not believe in communal sharing of food in this manner. This planning elective on non-essential travel to mainland China, Hong Kong, Hanoi, and Singapore may wish to postpone their trips until further notice. Again, China with at least 86 deaths. Unfortunate that it's increasing at all. It infected a lot of people from few people wearing these surgical masks wrongly all over the place. And they Now, my belief is that people coming into a country are so anxious to go and see their family or to go and go home. They will lie. Very few people have got the morality, shall we say, or the ethics to tell the truth when filling in questionnaires. And so I believe, and this is my own personal belief, I believe there should be some form of legislation to punish people who lie on filling in these questionnaires because the disease is too important to allow one case to get through undetected. The course of fever in SARS is not like you have it 24 hours a day. There are several hours a day where the fever might be up and down. And it might be that as the person was going through the screening in Hong Kong or Singapore, that was a period of time when they did not have fever. And just after two hours, when they get here, they might have fever. I think you should screen personally the temperature when they arrive here at all ports of entry.